The houses seem to be going up so fast that they almost seem to be going up in price faster than you can save for them. <laughs> We're renting a temporary house that's broken. Normally you can only really keep this room warm. If we brought a house, we could add improvements to the house. I just want a new house. <laughs> yes, so they want us to buy a house, I think. <laughs> because of the red zone and the loss of houses, yes, it does make it harder for them to find that entry-level house because the east was the entry-level suburb. It is a competitive market because the first-time buyer is often competing with an investor. They're all sort of after the same properties and they are a more um, confident buyer than the first home buyer and they compete more aggressively and they know what they're doing. Yeah, we both pretty much lost jobs, had to start again. I retrained as a plumber and now I'm working as a plumber. Why have we not bought a house? We haven't been able to buy a house yet because we... Um. We just don't earn quite enough. We don't earn quite enough to, to get make a mortgage, mortgage at the moment, so we need to um, increase our income. To buy a house in Christchurch, say an entry level in an average suburb, probably 320 to 350, maybe 380. That's on a, a, a normal size section. I mean, they might get a little bit cheaper if it's a cross lease section. Hmm. If we bought a 350. $1,000 house, I think our repayments would be around about $400 a week or slightly over. So if we were to buy a $400,000 house, that would just be too much. Really out of, out of our league, isn't it? The first time at least. It's a matter of being able to make those payments every week, which might be a push. In a perfect world, it would be lovely if the client had a 20% deposit, they had $70,000. They still can, though, get in various ways with only a 10% deposit. If we can meet the criteria for the welcome home loans, we can get a property with a 10% deposit, which is fortunate because we would really struggle to make 20%. There are quite a lot of rules to qualify for a welcome home loan, but basically joint income under $120,000 and a purchase price under $450,000. Yeah, I don't really know what our chances are of buying a house really. It's kind of wavering from week to week whether it's a good idea or not or whether we should be trying to push to get one or if it's just going to yeah, really turn tits up on us really. It's a bit of a worry. Yeah, I'm still confident but I think we're going to have to look very hard to find something that we can afford. Mm.